So do you feel confident coming on to campus here? Yeah. It's a pilot project approved by the Ministry of Colleges and Universities, allowing Fanshawe students who depend on in-person learning to walk back into the classroom. These are students from our winter semester, weren't able to finish their winter semester because they needed access to specialized labs like the lab we're in right now. They are here for anywhere from two weeks, three weeks. Luke is one of those students. Would you be able to do this online? No, no, not at all. So turning oxygen up to 100% for suction. Respiratory therapists are on the front lines of the pandemic, and these Fanshawe students are practicing intubation. We are the ones taking care of the airway. We're taking care of the vents. We're intubating patients. We're making sure the current COVID is all in our hands. It's really important that we continue to get respiratory therapy students through school and out joining the workforce. So any delay in that could be crucial during a respiratory pandemic. Only three to four students are allowed in a respiratory therapy classroom at a time. Plan for us to be able to social distance with our classmates. As well, we're all wearing masks, we're all sanitizing, so we're all being precautious. One of the sanitization protocols at campus starts right at the front door with the screening process. Difficulty swallowing, pink eye, or muscle aches. The dental program has curtains between each workstation and ops for mannequins. Plexiglass is also set up in classrooms where physical distancing is a challenge. Jordan Reed, CTV News.